and welcome to my new guitar nerdery video. Today it's gonna be a short one. I'm gonna show you a quick funny lick. It's a descending chromatic run I very often integrate into my solos and it sounds pretty much like Pac-Man dying. I use the chromatic scale for the lick and so it has not a special key so you can play it everywhere on the fretboard. Whatever you want, it works. In this video I started on the E on the high E string in the 12th fret. And the chromatic scale pattern I use goes like this. It's four notes per string. The concept of the lick is very simple and symmetrical. Just start on your starting point, wherever that may be. In my case, it's the E. And along the shape of my chromatic scale, I play a three note package. And the next one would be one note down the scale. And so on. But there's a tricky moment every time when you have to alternate between the strings. So you get this. Playing scales, most of us guitar players use two notes per string pattern or three notes per string pattern. In this case, for the lick, I use a chromatic scale, four notes per string pattern. And this is something I guess you have to really get used to. So even if this lick is simple and symmetrical in concept, it turns out to be not that easy to play when you speed it up. Be patient, start very slow and take the lick more seriously than it sounds. If you're a fast picker, you can pick every note. You can adapt your technique to the lick. I play it like this. Every first note on the string, I'm gonna pick with the plectrum or plug it with the finger. I use hybrid picking. And the rest is pull-offs and hammer-ons. And there's a tricky moment when we have to alternate between the strings and then the hybrid picking comes in very handy. So I'm gonna play it very slow for you so you can see what I'm doing. If you're not so much into left hand legato technique, I guess the most difficult thing for you is to manage these pull offs from the pinky to the third finger. <coughs> Something you have really to get used to. Hey, this was a short one. I hope you liked it. Please like and subscribe. And I'm looking forward, of course to see you next time.